Hello everyone, welcome to a Small Terrible channel. Today we are going to show you the module 1 of quarter 2. But before that, let me show you the process so that whenever you receive the soft copy, you'll know how to open it. Right, so first thing to do, go to your downloaded software. So that's Kotobi Reader. So I have here, just open it. Just wait. Okay, after you have opened it, just click this icon here, open EPA file. Then you look for the you look for the file that I have uh, given to you. Okay, just click on it then open. Just wait. Alright, so ito yung um, ibinigay ko sa inyo. Okay? So, ito po ang ating nagawa na sa quarter 2. Okay, so quarter 1 ay bigay ko na sa inyo. Ito ang quarter 2 natin. So, parts of the microscope and their function. This is the module 1. So, in this module, you will learn to identify parts of the microscope and their function. So, that is the most essential learning competency. And the objectives, at the end of this module, you enumerate parts of the microscope, write the functions of the different parts of the microscope, and show willingness to enumerate the parts and functions of the microscope. So, napaka madaling sundan lang nito guys, kapag may mga anak kayo, may mga um, kakilala kayo na incoming grade 7, pwede ninyo ito ipamigay sa kanila. Um, ito ay self-learning module. Meron tayong unlocking of difficulties. Ano pang ibig sabihin ng microscope? It's an instrument that can be used to observe small objects, even cells. And we have compound microscope. It's a high power or high magnification microscope that uses a compound lens system. Okay? So, kapag mag-proceed lang tayo sa next page, click lang natin ito dito. And we have this free assessment. Okay? Meron tayong free assessment na sasagutan bago magsisimula sa pinaka-topic. So, just select true if it's a correct statement and false if it's not. So, let me answer this. Okay, let me just answer without reading. Anyway, this is for the sake of illustration. But whenever your children or mga kakilala ninyo ang mag-answer, please let them read it well so that they will answer the, they can answer the correct ones. So, just submit answers. And we have the, okay, the summary of our score. So, take note, kapag 7 ang ang nakuha nila still failed because I said it that the passing score is 8. Right? So, and ang nakita ninyo dito, nagha-highlight yung mga tamang tamang answer. Katulad ng answer ko sa number 3. True yun. True ang sineselect ko pero ang tama pala ay false. Right? So, kapag matapos na silang mag-answer at isubmit nila, makita nila na ay, hindi pala tama yung answer ko sa number 3 at uh, ma corrected nila yung kanilang maling answer. Alright? So, pagkatapos nyan, next lang, at meron tayo dito, do this. So, ito ay isang um, dashboard 
carousel. Okay? So, ang gawin lang nila, i-click lang ito. Okay? At uh, dito, kilalanin nila ang iba't ibang parte ng microscope. So, eyepiece is nandito. This is the body tube. Then, the objectives. Then, the frame or basically, this is the arm. The coarse adjustment knob, the fine adjustment knob, elimination intensity knob. This is the base. This is the basically call this the mirror or the illuminator. The condenser, then the diaphragm, the stage. The stage clip is also there. No piece. Then the objectives. Then they had this a different fire first scope though. Head or the body tube by the way. Body tube and her head are just the same. Then we have here the ocular lens or the eyepiece. Another word uh, given to eyepiece is ocular. Then body tube or head. Revolving nose piece, objectives, stage clips, diaphragm, light source, illuminator. Then we have the base, the fine adjustment knob, the coarse adjustment knob, the stage, the arm. Right? For the next picture, dito na siya. So, we're trying to answer until we arrive at the blank in which you are the one who will enumerate it yourself. Okay, pagkatapos, i-X lang natin, proceed tayo sa next page. I-click lang natin itong next dito. At mag explore na tayo. Just click on the image. So, dito, you are going to answer this crossword puzzle. So, pwede ninyo itong mamove kasi hindi makikita, no? Okay, it's up to you to move it. So, for example, brings the specimen to general focus. What could be the answer? So, you can have, okay. Okay, then... Kung matapos na ninyo itong ma-answer, ma-fill in na ninyo itong lahat, just click. Like, for example, number 9 na naman. Kasi tapos na yan. I-enter lang yan. Number 9 ka na naman. Okay? So, just type on the words using the keyboard that you have there. Then, kapag tapos na yan, ma-fill in, mag-fit in na lahat ng letters dyan, magka-highlight lang yan. Magko-color green lahat from yellow. Kasi, tama na. Tama na ang mga sagot nyo. So, just click delete if hindi pa kayo sure. Okay. Then, proceed na tayo sa next page. Dito na ang uh, mga uh, abstraction part natin. The discussion part of the top. Okay. So, the structural parts of the microscope, the optical parts of the microscope, we have it here. Okay. Just read on this. Then, we have this application. Just click again on the picture. Okay, so dito, i-identify na ninyo. So, ano ba ito? So, i-type lang using the keyboard. I piece. Okay. Enter lang. Punta ka na dito. Um, R. Okay. Dito, stage. Next. This is course adjust now. This is okay. Kung gusto ninyo, pwede yung copy paste lang. Ano? Control C, Control V. Palitan ninyo ito na fine adjustment na. Okay, sakali, tapos na tayo nag-answer, just click show answers. Yes. At makikita ninyo dyan, okay, my check mark at ang score ninyo. Okay? So, yan lang kadali. Meron tayong answer key agad-agad. Next, just click. Ito na naman. Okay, so just click on the picture again. 
din ito ay isang fill in the blank. So, without, so, ano kayang answer natin? Light, for example. This what? Supposing we are done with these answers, just click show answers. Yes. And we have the correct answer and our score is 2 over 10. So, as easy as that. Okay. Alright. So, i-x lang natin to. Then, next na tayo. So, dito na tayo sa assessment part. So, pagkatapos ng discussion sa ng buong module, punta na tayo sa assessment part. I-assess natin kung hanggang saan tayo natututo. Okay? Kapag hindi kayo nag-pass nito, um, ulitin nyo lang. Okay? Mga estudyante. Okay? A compound light microscope uses a series of lenses to magnify an object. So, let me answer this true. So, I'll just answer this without reading for the sake of illustration so that we won't be very, ano, matagal dito. Kasi ako kapag mag-answer talaga ako ay binabasa ko talaga lahat at ano, nag- twice reading pa talaga ako kaya medyo matagalan tayo nito. So, submit answer <laughs> and see, I did not read it. So, I failed it because I did not read it. So, dapat talaga basahin ng maigi ang mga tanong para tayo makapag-answer ng tama. Okay, so again, I set the passing mark as 8. So, kaya pag 5 ang nakuha ng mga anak ninyo ay talagang failed yung ano, mag- magtatatak. Next, tayo. Next page. Okay, so ito na ay isang glossary. Okay, glossary ito sa mga words na natutunan natin sa at sa module na ito. Then, we have the answer key portion. Then, may note tayo na every after the activities Answers are readily available. So, hindi ko na isinulat dito. Pero, inilagay ko lang itong answer key portion para for the sake of illustration that this is one of the parts of the module or parts of the structure of the module. Then, we have the references. These are the references wherein we have a reference this uh, module that we have. Then, we're done with our module 1 for the quarter 2. Okay, so thank you so much and yeah, basically I'm working now in module 2 of quarter 2. So thank you so much um, for being with me right now, for, for listening with me. So I hope you can share this to everyone who needs. Um, this is a self-learning module. So if you want to have a copy of this, just comment uh, your email at below and I am willing to share this for free okay so thank you so much just don't forget to subscribe to be notified of our next uploads because slowly we're going to make all this um, from quarter 1 to quarter 4 a self-learning module okay so thank you so much and mabuhay po kayo Solo Educalidad.